Hey kids, and welcome to Click Infusion 2.5 tutorial. So in this tutorial, we will be learning uh, randomized ca counters. Like, uh, when you open up a frame, it gives a random counter number. This was suggested by that guy across the street. I call him to get, you know. Okay, so, create a new application. Wait, it hit me, no, God damn it. Okay, so let's add a counter and let's make it in the center or like we can do this. Here, let's put it here. So um, let's uh, let's add some actives. Let's add three actives and let's add some random photos like here what's an apple juice you know uh, I can't do the apple juice voice anymore my voice sucks my voice is rip in peace actually let me try it but it won't be good I can tell you Okay, my voice is getting really, really weird right now because you know uh, my voice has changed in these months and I suck. But at least there was an old recording of it three months ago, or actually two. Yeah, two. Let's add uh, ads because why not? And let's add a Dree's post because I, I didn't have any ideas for what the dirt ones was gonna be. Let's make this smaller. You don't need to find these images by the way. <laughs> so let's put them here all together. And, uh, like, mm, make sure your counters until value is zero. Well, let's make the minimum value zero. Okay, we don't. Okay. So, go to the event editor and, uh, okay, okay start a frame. Oh, by the way, don't forget this. Make make sure all of them are invisible, and let's rename them. Rename them. Like this one should be three. This one should be two, and this one should be one. So, at the start of frame, set the counter to R random one to three, because it's gonna be a number between. One, two, and three. And what? It's gonna be uh, one uh, between one and three, and these gonna be these three numbers: one, two, and three. So once you did this counter, hit OK, and let's add some. You know, let's do what I do. Compare the counter to our value. One. Let's make this two. And let's make this 3. So, when the counter becomes 1 at start of frame, let's make sure this is visible. When at start of frame it becomes 2, make sure this is visible. And as the same thing, make sure this is visible. I don't know, but I like actually doing these on, is invisible on the other. So, let's hit start, you know, run the application. 3. Uh, you know, one, scan one, one again, three, two. 
yeah. Um, let's add a background for this. That'll be good. Let's add purple. So, um, if you want to do with directions, um, let's add a second way. Because why not? Let's do, add, add this first way. Let's clone it. And let's rename it second way. So in second way, uh, let's just do this. Five ways to kill a toilet. Let's put it at this direction. Let's put upper use in one of the directions of the ads. Let's make it up. So you can delete these. Oh, this is the first time I'm going to delete an object. Nope. So, this hand should be there. And we don't need to, to make it reappear. So, when it's one, the direction should be this this place. It can be vis visible, by the way. Let's make it visible. Make sure it's visible. Direction and. Then, when it becomes second, it should be apple juice, which is up. And on the third one, you can make the you know five ways to kill a toilet. Now let's try it. You can you know run the frame, not the application, because when, if you run the application, it will start the first frame. If you make sure you run frame, it will start this frame. So one. Three, two. So as you see, it worked. So uh, this MFA file, example file, will be in the description below. And I'll see you guys next time.